Pestigirl River State Forest. You can find some of these on Strava under segments. There's not many routes. Routes, routes. It's whatever. Not many, just if you're under segments, you can see some of these. This is the warm up on the Porterfield, Wisconsin side of the river. Short little lap. training in about driving up to Marquette three times a week so. parking lot and you look left see a sign for the west trails there's a nice loop over here and that's on uh, Strava it's a segment it's called um, the west big loop it's like 1.75 miles once you get out here it's pretty fun check it out right here to the right. normally tell they're here there'll be the horse trailers in the parking lot but not always all right you take a left up here and there are a lot of trails back here some of them are marked there's a lot of loops that go off other loops this will be the west big loop I believe it's called in Strava Here. 
Yeah, it's all single track back here. side here. another fire road service road we're gonna hang a right trail does go straight just trying to stick to the segment back on right here.
Downhill action. Two seconds. A little shortcut still keeps you on the segment. Right here, we stay straight. Sharp corner, washed out there. segment. So going right here, we'll get us back to the car. I think you can put on like 14 miles out here. Not a lot of elevation at all, but 
it's still nice. Rarely run into anybody, and if you do, they're always friendly. So thing right here. To go left there, first I'm gonna go right here, and there's a loop just through these pines on this side of the road. Pretty nice. Some of these trails we're coming up on on the other side of the road, I was told were old fire ditches. So they're actually just big ruts, burned out. Pretty fun. So you hang right here. And we're gonna come out to Bagley Road, gravel road here. Straight across. See a sign that says East Trails. And these are those ditches I was telling you about. You can see they're firm, so you can't really handle anything you throw at them. Some roots back here. Nothing horrible. out and back that's another segment there still haven't really figured it out just a bunch of open-ended circles here off like figure eight I can't really tell do I go right do I go left but um, I'm gonna stick on this the east loop
There's the end of that. Left would take us back where we came from. Right takes us to the north trails. I like these back here. Check it out. here towards the north trail. There's the only jump <laughs> maybe back here coming up. This will turn into single track. And you're gonna go flat, but you can still send it. in here <laughs> right here Looks like they just mowed. Pretty cool back here. It's kind of like a, I don't know, reservoir, backwater area of the Peshigo River. There's got to be some nice fishing. So, 
<laughs> up here on the left, North Trail. Oh, there we go. This can get really confusing back here. All of this can, honestly, but you can't really get lost. You just end up doing circles. So. Basically, when you come in here, you can either go left or right. And uh, one is your entrance, one's the return. Take it how you like it. If you go right here, you could do another little loop. Just comes back right there. It's very short. Stay left there. Not sure where that goes. Just be another shortcut to get wherever we're headed right here. Okay. So, there's a lot going on here. Here's the four corners. This is called spin cycle. This will get you back to where we came from. And if we go right here, it'll bring us out even further and do a loop. So let's go check that out. All right. I think this adds another mile or so on is all. Um, you can go right or left. I'd rather go right.
right. Go left here. Brings you out to another boat launch. trails and then we gotta head back through the east trails across the road back to the trailhead where we came from. This is spin cycle. I'm gonna head straight up this way. There was um, some snapping turtle eggs in a big hole on this trail up here about a month ago. Looks like it's covered up. gotta go right here. If you go left, you'll end up doing a big circle. Camber going in. It's called the hiker biker trail. Uh, so you gotta watch out. Some of these are two way trails. 
Miles in? Yeah, first time here, I just kind of... Oh yeah. A local guy, a tired fella with a camp. Never been out here, just finding it himself. Pretty cool. Now we run into nice people out here if I run into anyone at all. Where we came from. Here's a trail we didn't hit yet. Actually, we moved right back to where we came in. So I convert and leave it for last. Like this. It's a tree that'll slap you in the face down here. Bringing us back to the East Trails. If you're ready to go back to the car, you can always just keep hanging right. Probably what I'm gonna do right now. So that this video isn't too crazy long. Right 
here. That would have been the East Trail again, the East Loop. We already did that. Like I said, if you run everything back and forth, hang right, you get about 14 miles. I don't know what this is gonna get us. We didn't do very much in the west side, so we just ran the 1.75 mile loop. And then did a little bit of the east. And some of the north. There's little offshoots to all of these. Towards the car. We're just gonna want to hang right, <clears throat> hang right here, and then kind of forced to go across here. parking lot. 